Okay, the road brings me to New Orleans, Louisiana, and we are outside of the Voodoo Museum. We're gonna go inside and learn a little bit about voodoo, and you get to come along. But, right after this station, identification. I had to go back and re-edit this video because of a copyright infringement. Apparently the music belonged to someone else. So we're going to redo it and I'll give you a little history of voodoo in New Orleans. New Orleans voodoo, as it is known, originated when West Africans fleeing Haiti came to Louisiana and brought their religious beliefs. They merged those beliefs with the local Catholic population. Voodoo is a religion that's connected to nature, spirits, and ancestors. By the early 1800s in New Orleans, there were voodoo priests and queens and even political figures. The central belief of New Orleans voodoo is that one God doesn't necessarily interfere with their daily lives, but spirits do. And those that practice voodoo can connect with these spirits through rituals, dance, music, chanting, and even snakes. Today, in various shops all across New Orleans, you can buy all types of potions, and even voodoo dolls have seen here. Authentic voodoo dolls are handcrafted by the practitioner and they represent a particular voodoo spirit. Then they are ritualized and consecrated to bring these dolls to life with the energies of those voodoo spirits. And it's about this time I really start getting the heebie-jeebies. There are all types of statues and even this black cat juju. Black cats are revered as good luck and hoodoo, particularly in gambling and matters such as playing the card and lottery. Black cat juju dolls are sought out for their good luck. As you can see, there are little bits of Catholicism mixed in with voodoo. Here is a voodoo wishing stump. According to Cora, voodoo is a religion that's practiced chiefly in Haiti, but also has its roots in West Africa. Practitioners of voodoo believe in the Supreme God, but since they believe God is unreachable, the voodoo person will pray to the spirits. This is the three-headed juju. He is mocking the spirits by sticking his tongue out at them. Here is the gift shop where you can purchase your very own voodoo doll. There sure is a lot of spooky stuff in here and I think I am about to the point where I'm going to leave. I hope you have enjoyed this video and if you did be sure to give me a big old thumbs up. Be sure to tell your family and friends and until next time, 
Y'all have a good day.